what's up glam squad and welcome back to my channel i hope everybody has been doing well and if you are new here welcome and in today's video i will be showing you guys how i semi attempted to do croc nails um this is my first time trying this pattern which didn't come out too bad um I actually got inspired by this picture I will put it in the screen so I just wanted to let you guys know the creator of that set in the picture her Instagram was by underscore J Queen and then I kind of added my own little twist to it so I hope you guys like this look and if you do make sure to watch the video until the end don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can be notified anytime I post. And of course, share, share, share. And before I continue the video, I am doing a voiceover. So if you guys hear any noise outside, they are doing construction in my area. So I apologize in advance. But yeah, guys, let's get started. First thing is first, I went ahead and filed and buffed my Kiara Sky Long Jelly Tip Coffin Nails. And after that, I went ahead and put a coat of my Valentino Beauty Pure Base Coat. After I cured that base coat, I'm going to go ahead with a white gel polish. Um, in particular, I am using this one because it's not as thick as my Valentino Beauty Pure White. Um, so I'm going to be using this white and mixing it with base coat and the reason why I did that was because I wanted to get like a milky white but I noticed that while I was coating the nails with the color that I created it was a little too light so it looked a little patchy so the white ended up looking like a regular white but just a little later if that makes sense kind of like a marshmallow color all right guys so this is the finished look for the white which would be the base so moving on i'm going to be using the same brands of liner brushes so i'm going to be using number one 12 15 and 17 so I'm going to be going in with that royal blue color, which is number 12. After that, I'm going to clean it up, make sure everything looks sharp, and then go in with number one, which is the gold, to do an outline. And after that, I go in with both greens using a dotting tool. I went ahead and jumped to the pinky because I was doing the same design as the thumb. So everything that I did on the thumb, I did exactly on the pinky as well. Just to let you guys know, so I did not use a blooming gel, which is what makes the pattern spread out. So what I used was actually base coat. I've seen other YouTubers use base coat instead of blooming gel. So that's what I used, but you could use either or moving on to the ring finger so i'm gonna take that number 12 and put it all over the nail after that i'm gonna cure it and go ahead with a layer of base coat and then i'm gonna start dotting the green colors on now i'm gonna jump on to the index finger and the index finger was a little hard for me because I was trying to do like a ombre of three colors and both greens was fine because it was a lighter uh, green and a darker green but they still mixed in together but when it came to the blue and the darker green it was a little hard to kind of blend in together but you guys get the point and that actually ended up being one of my favorite nails but I just wish it would have blended a little better. Last 
last but not least we're doing the middle finger and the reason why i left the middle finger for last is because i'm not the greatest at doing french so it takes me a little bit more time when i'm doing a french um i've been trying different techniques the one i'm doing right here i've seen it on instagram and it does help a little bit so yeah guys so right now i'm just gonna clean up the nail a little bit make sure that french is crisp after that i'm going to be going in with my base coat again do not cure it just leave the base coat as it is and then you go in with your dotting tool and start putting the green color to make the design I didn't like how the French looked alone, so I just went ahead with that gold color and outlined the French. Don't mind the lighting, it was a little off in this shot, but yeah guys, this is the finished design. I hope you guys liked it, and this was something new for me. I always usually try to stick to like the nude, pinks, purple, stuff like that. So I wanted to try something new and I definitely loved how this set came out. Um, I do need to practice the actual design a little more. Maybe I will end up buying a blooming gel to see how the results come out with the blooming gel. But I can't complain for my first time, it wasn't that bad and actually these nails got a lot of attention which i did not think they would so i'm very happy about that but yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did like i said don't forget to hit that like button before exiting the video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you could be notified anytime i post and of course share 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 Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.